everybody, this is Justin, and I wanted to make a very quick video and post it to the VI phone list and also my website at justinromack.com. Probably need to actually build a page related to the iPhone, but this video is going to be about the double tap uh, gesture that you use for multiple things, mainly answering and ending a call, also the start and stop function for the iPod, and with a single finger and double tapping, you can actually do the bypass gesture feature, or delete icons off of the home screen. There's lots of things that that comes in handy with. So I wanted to do this quick video. I'm basically going to show you the rhythm that I do it. It is very quick and most of the people that I'm seeing that are having issues with it probably just don't understand how quick it really is. Um, once you get it, you won't have any problems with it. I, I rarely have problems answering or ending a, a phone call or stopping the iPod or, or playing or whatever the case may be. And any time that I do have problems, it's my fault, not the phone. So I want to show you this. I'm going to have a phone call, simulate a phone call, and then also show you a couple times just with the iPod so that hopefully you can get the rhythm down from, from my example. So my phone is ringing. I'm going to take my pointer finger and my middle finger, and I'm just going to tap the screen like this. Tap, tap. Hello? Hello? Hey! Thank you very much for calling me. No problem. I don't really want to talk to you. I just want to make an example of you. Okay. So what I'm going to do is take the same two fingers, the pointer finger and the middle finger, and in the middle of the screen, it really has, there's really no uh, right spot on the screen to actually do it. You can do it any place on the screen, but I take my fingers and I just tap tap. And now the call is ended. So you're hearing that the process is tap, tap. It's very quick. It's not just a tap, tap. You're actually tapping two times very, very quickly. So tap, tap. Um, I'm, I'm back at my home screen now. And what I'm going to do is I have a song queued up in iTunes. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to do the tap, tap gesture again, the double tap. And I'm going to show you how quickly you're doing it. We'll just do it a couple times. I'll, I'll start the music, then pause it, and then start it again. So, tap, tap. It's playing. Tap, tap. So, tap, tap. That stopped it. Tap, tap. Tap, tap. Tap, tap. And both fingers are touching at the same time. It's very, very quick. Um, let me go ahead and I'll t I'm taking a single finger and I'm moving it around the screen. 7.31 p.m. Slide heel. Music 2. I've got a program here, a Direct TV app. I've selected it with my single finger. Now I've removed my finger from the screen and I'm going to take a single finger, which is my pointer finger. I'm going to tap twice quickly with the one finger to select that item. So we're going to do that really quick. So it's tap, tap. Now it's selected that, and we're in the application. Right. Sir, sir. Text the, oh, oh. the whole process is a little oh, tricky to get used to originally. I, I did have a couple problems with that, and I know that's the common problem initially. So I wanted to make this quick video. I hope that helps. I myself initially didn't understand how quickly you had to do it. So it would have helped to have some sort of audio demonstration like this. If you have any further questions, don't hesitate to get in touch with me. I'm on Twitter. My username is Justin Romack, R-O-M-A-C-K. I'm also at justinromack.com, or you can reach me at jromack at gmail.com. And I'd love to help you any way I can. And uh, until next time, I hope this helps. Thanks a lot.